Well, we're definitely talking about much cooler temps around the region. We have reinforcing cool fronts sliding out of Canada. And this next one could be enough to bring widespread frost and freeze conditions to the northern tier of the nation as we head into the next couple of days, especially again in the Midwest here. But looking at some snow showers potentially as well. We'll start you off with the Saturday morning lows here in Minnesota and North Dakota, even Wisconsin. This could be the first widespread frost and freeze of the season for these particular locations. Those seasonal allergy sufferers and those that can't stand the mosquitoes will be happy about this. Uh, but that'll just kind of help to uh, really get those fall colors going across uh, the northern tier of the nation as well. Saturday morning lows even down in Des Moines could be approaching 40 degrees. Precipitation yesterday was heavy in Cleveland, picking up an inch and a quarter, another half inch in Louisville. That brings us to now for the month of September, 10.87 and the wettest September in recorded history there. And 7.7 .7 inches of rain in Des Moines, five inches above average in the Minneapolis region, four inches above average for the season. We have some rain over the Ohio Valley, another reinforcing cold front sweeping through the upper Mississippi Valley. Snow in the highest elevations, which will be adding up. Uh, winter weather advisories there. But even early Friday morning, looking at some scattered snow showers across far northern Minnesota. Not looking at much in terms of additional heavy rainfall. Uh, again, watching the uh, frost and freeze concerns across parts of uh, the far north. Uh, 49 degrees today in International Falls and 53 in Fargo.